Good morning, boys and girls. I love today. Today is Mother's Day, and I hope you're doing something special for all the moms and grandmas and aunts um, and other women in your life. They do so much for you. Life would be really boring and kind of not so good without those people in it. Whether or not they have kids or don't have kids, all those women are just amazing. So let's sing about them, okay? So the first song we're going to sing is Dearest Names. And if you don't know that song, it's okay. We're going to sing both verses. First time we're going to talk about mother and then mommy, just for fun, okay? Because there's lots of different ways that we can call our moms, okay? But first one, we're going to say mother. I know a name, a glorious name, dearer than any other. Listen, I'll whisper that name to you. It is the name of Mother. Mother so tender and kind and true. I love you, I love you. Mother so tender and kind and true. I love you. I know a name, a glorious name, dearer than any other. Listen, I'll whisper the name to you. It is the name of Mommy. Mommy so tender and kind and true. I love you. I love you. Mommy so noble and brave and true. I love you. All mommies are noble and brave and kind. There's so many things about our moms that are just so amazing. I especially like being called noble and brave. It makes me think that I'm a knight <laughs> going off to, you know, slay my children's dragons. I like that. Um, so the second song that we're going to do is Mother Tell Me a Story, right? And we're gonna do a puppet show with it. All right, you ready for a puppet show? We learned the song last year for Mother's Day. Um, and let's see if we can remember it, okay? Mother, tell me the story that I love to hear. Tell me of heaven and why I came here. Mother, tell how you love me, then gently speak, and then I'll go to sleep. Again. Mother, tell me the story that I love to hear. Tell me of heaven and why I came here. Mother, tell how you love me, then gently speak, and then I'll go to sleep. Do your moms tell you stories? and read you stories. I think one of the most amazing stories out there is the one that I showed you is the one about Jesus, of how he was in heaven with us. And there was a big plan that he would come to earth and he would die and he would suffer for all of our sins. And it was going to be hard, but he was going to do it because without him, we wouldn't be able to go back to our heavenly father and how brave and noble was jesus and how much he loves us and i love hearing this story especially told by the people that i love like my mom all right let's go ahead and sing our next song which is a hand action one okay so just follow along. We've never sung this one before. It's like one of those never sung in the hymn book, but it's so good, okay? So let's do it. We're gonna roll our hands, okay? Roll your hands, roll your hands, as slowly, as slowly, as slow can be. Then fold your arms like me, like me, then fold your arms like me. 
Good job. Okay, we're gonna do it one more time and it's gonna be a little bit different. Roll your hands, roll your hands as quickly, as quickly as quick can be. Then fold your arms like me, like me, then fold your arms like me. Oh, good job. That was a good one. So now let's sing a reverence song about the commandments. We sang this one way long ago at the beginning of January. And if you don't recall, maybe you've talked about it with your families this week, um, but Abinadi, one of the most amazing prophets that I ever learned about, he taught the wicked King Noah about the commandments. And the commandments are really important because they are a way for God to show us that he loves us. Commandments bring us blessings and peace and happiness and obeying them is a way to show our love back to Heavenly Father. Um, so let's sing this song and I think you're gonna enjoy doing it with the flute. All right, so keep the commandments. We're gonna do it two times. First time is I'm just gonna sing it and then the second time I'm not gonna be there to sing it with you because I'm going to play a little melody above it. So you should be able to hear the melody still and just sing along or hum it or just think of the words yourself. Something I wanted to do that's a little bit different. Keep the commandments, keep the commandments in this. There is safety in this, there is peace. He will send blessings. like that. That was fun for me. I um, hope and believe that we'll be able to sing that all together with me playing, you singing, and Sister Bake playing our piano. Won't that be so much fun? Oh, I can't wait. All right. I don't know about you, but it's been very windy at my house lately, and I love the wind. It reminds me that, I don't know, I just love the feeling of the wind blowing me just feels very comforting for me for some reason so let's sing a song about the wind blowing everything around us okay wind is blowing all around on the rooftops on the ground wind is blowing on my nose on my head and hands and toes good should we do that one more time? Just a little bit faster? Actually, let's do it a lot bit faster. Ready? Wind is blowing all around On the rooftops on the ground Wind is blowing on my nose On my head and hands and toes Wow, oh, that was great! Okay, so our next song is also a song about nature. It is whenever I hear the song of a bird. And I wonder, what do you love about nature? What do you love about being outside? And does it remind you of Heavenly Father's love for you? Because he created this beautiful world for us to enjoy. It's beautiful for us. And I just love it. Um, let's sing this song. We're gonna sing both verses and Let's have fun, okay? You can follow along with your act the actions if you want.
my ears that I might hear the magical sound of things. He gave me my life, my mind, my heart. I thank Him reverently for all the creation of which I'm a part. Yes, I know every father loves me. Last week, I went on a hike with my family and I just took a really short video that I want to share with you of just the outdoors. I love it. It just makes me feel more grounded and connected with God. It just, it's very peaceful for me and I'd love to share it with you. I'm grateful for our world. There's so many beautiful things to explore and see so wonderful. I'm grateful for Heavenly Father for creating this beautiful place for us. All right, let's do Nephi's Courage. I love this one. Um, we haven't sung it for a while, so let's review it. And But we're also going to learn or sing for the first time the third verse, okay? So just follow your a the actions along and sing, okay? The Lord commanded Nephi to go and get the plates. From the wicked Laban inside the city gates, Laban and Lemuel were both afraid to try. Nephi was courageous, this was his reply. I will go, I will do the things the Lord commands. I know the Lord provides a way, he wants me to obey. I will go, I will do the things the Lord The Lord commanded Nephi to go and build a boat. Nephi's older brothers believed it would not float. Bopping and walking, they said he should not try. Nephi was courageous, this was his reply. I will go, I will do the things the Lord commands. I know the Lord provides a way he wants me to obey. I will go, I will do the things the Lord commands. I know the Lord provides a way he wants me to obey. The Lord gives us commandments and asks us to obey. Sometimes I am tempted to choose another way. When I'm discouraged and think I cannot try, I can be courageous, this and will reply. I will go, I will do the things the Lord commands. I know the Lord provides a way He wants me to obey. I will go, I will do the things the Lord commands. I know the Lord provides a way He wants me to obey. Awesome. I love that song. Um, tell me, how are you courageous like Nephi? Send me a video. I want to hear, how are you courageous like Nephi? It could be a big thing or a small thing. I want to hear about it, okay? And we'll put it in the video for next week. All right, so now let's do head, shoulders, knees, and toes, all right? And I wanna do it three times. Slow medium, and so fast that I doubt you can catch up, okay? So, I'm gonna step back here, and let's do this. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes, knees and toes. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, eyes, ears, mouth and nose. Okay, a little bit faster. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes, knees and toes. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, eyes, ears, mouth and nose. All right, you ready? Head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes, knees and toes. Head, shoulders, knees and toes, eyes, ears, mouth and nose. Oh, whew, that was fun. Okay, so our last song that we're going to sing is I Love to See the Temple, right? All right, I Love to See the Temple. Have you been to look at the temple recently? It's not open right now, but we can go 
to the grounds and look at the temple. That's one of the things I like doing. You can just feel the peace and the happiness that is present even on the grounds. It's a very holy place. And I know that you can receive peace and love and answers even without going inside the temple. All right, let's go ahead and sing this song. so much. I hope you're doing really well and enjoying the beautiful, beautiful weather. Heavenly Father and Jesus love you even more. Bye!